This is Leo from the PC Security Channel, and you are watching Avast vs. 360. We will be comparing two of the most popular free products out there, and arguably two of the best when it comes to detection ratio. We are going to have detection of PUPs turned on, and in Avast case, we will have heuristics set to high, as you can see right now. Of course, we are going to ensure that the products are up to date before we get started. We have a malware pack of over 1,000 items, 1,134 to be precise. These are somewhere between a couple of days to a week old. Once we get the green light from, from Avast, which we just did, we are going to start the test. So as usual, we'll do, be doing a context menu scan for both products. Avast is really quick with the scan. As usual, we will be deleting the files to make sure that whatever's left in the folder is the actual number. Unfortunately, it's not going to be this simple for 360. But as for Avast, it's quite black and white, so whatever's left in the folder should be the exact detection ratio, which turns out to be 99.6%, which is quite impressive. Now moving on to 360. As you can see, we have all the engines enabled, including Bitdefender and Avira. Once again, I'm going to show you that the detection of PUPs is enabled. The usual check for updates as well. And now that everything is ready, we can do our context menu scan again. Keep in mind though, 360 does not provide a dedicated delete option. So this is going to be tricky. We have the same folder though with 1134 items, just like in case of Avast. Here goes the scan. So as you can see, it only gives us a resolve option, which means some threats might be renamed or um, it might delete some files inside the archive. So we're going to do the calculation both ways. We're going to check the number of files inside the folder as well as the number reported by the product. As you can see, some files have been modified, so we're going to delete those because th those are no longer malicious. So all formats other than EXE were deleted, and based on that, we get a detection ratio of 87.8%, which is probably not the case. It's probably 999 .9 based on what 360 detects, but it's up to you which numbers you want to go by. I hope you enjoyed this test. Please leave a like if you enjoyed it, and comment down below your thoughts regarding these products. This was a quick test and you're watching TPSC. Stay informed, stay secure.